The Necklace is a satire story that gives a strong message on human values. The very first thing that this lesson teaches us is that everyone should be content in life with whatever little that he or she has. But first, let's discover who is the man behind this masterpiece. The man behind this masterpiece is Mr. Henry René Albert Guy de Maupassant. He was a 19th century French author remembered as a master of short story form, as well as representative of naturalist school, who depicted human lives, destinies, and social forces in disillusioned and often pessimistic terms. Once upon a time, in the city of love, Paris, France, there's a young beautiful woman named Mathilda, who is unhappy with her life and marries a low-paid clerk who tries his best to make her happy. One day, Mathilda's husband brings home an invitation to a fancy ball hosted by the Ministry of Education. Mathilda is thrilled at the prospect of attending the ball, but then she is despondent when she realizes that she has nothing to wear. Her husband offers to buy her a new dress, but she insists that she needs a jewelry to complete her outfit. One day, Mathilda visits her wealthy friend Jean and borrow a necklace, and there she found a beautiful diamond necklace. She attends the ball with her husband and she had fun, but when she returns home, she realizes that she has lost the necklace. She and her husband search frantically for the necklace, but it is nowhere to be found. They cannot afford to replace the necklace, so they take out loans and work tirelessly to pay off their debt. Ten years later, Mathilda is walking to the market and sees Jean and tells her the story of the lost necklace. Jean is surprised and tells Mathilda that the necklace was actually a fake, worth only a fraction of what they had paid to replace it. Mathilda is devastated by the realization that her years of hard work and suffering were for nothing. <laughs>